What's good, YouTube? It's your boy ATK React back with a reaction, and today we back with another SML video, bro. Now I took a little break from them, but we coming right back with that pause. So it's time to see what the gang getting into, and not only SML, it's Brooklyn guy. That's my favorite character from the SML things, so I'm excited to see that. But if you're not sub, hit that sub button, hit that like button, and let's get to it. All right, y'all, this is SML movie. Brooklyn guy's missing wife, man. Let's see. I know, I know, he hate her. He hate her with a passion, bro. He really don't like her. So let's see how that happens. Boy, he probably happy about it though. Karen, that's not a microphone, Ew. it's a toilet brush. Speak into the mic, Boiny, they can't hear you. Karen, get that out she, of my face. She over there flinging dookie water all over the couch. It smells like poop. Wait, you said it's a brush? Let me brush your hair. Get that away oh from me, it's wet gosh. from all the piss water. It's a toilet brush, you use it to clean toilets. Bro, that dookie water on his head. Boiny? Well, you use it after you flush in case there's leftovers. Ew, what do I do with it now? I don't know, throw it away at this point. Oh, Bruh, yeah, she literally do great. it. That's great, Karen. You know, sometimes I think my life would be better without you. <gasps> Damn. You don't mean that, boy. That's tough. Yes, I do. <laughs> Look how fast I'm nodding. Hey, yeah. Uh... me! Oh, my. Who's, Who's robbing you? Where'd they get a flashbang from, bro? It's some Call of Duty? Boy, hey! Oh, my. Shut up! <laughs> Oh boy, what the hell the front. Was, that? was that a flash thing? Wait, wait, they just kidnapped my wife. He was oh celebrating. God. What am I gonna do? Woo! Yeah, shake those knockers. Hey! <laughs> oh, celebrating. I knew it. Oh, I knew man. it, bro. Pose. That was great. Well, I guess I should probably call the cops and report. You're my the wife cops. Kidnapped. I might you called the cops. Yeah, guy, what's going on? Somebody kidnapped my wife. Your wife? Yeah, we were just sitting on the couch, minding our own business, and I was telling her how much happier I would be without her, and then all of a sudden, these two random guys broke in, and they threw a flashbang at us, and they kidnapped her. And then I went to the strip club to grieve. Well, why didn't to you grieve. call us first? Well, you know, to I go had to the strip to go club. to the strip club, you know, to, to grieve. Wait a minute, guy, didn't you take out a huge life insurance policy on your wife just a few days ago? Well, yeah, but that's because she got in her third car accident, and I figured, Hey, if she's gonna die, I might as well make some money off of it. Oh my! Well, you know, mate, that does sound suspicious. What? No, no, no! You guys don't actually think I hired somebody to kill my wife just because I told her I would be happier without her, and I took out a big life insurance policy on her, and I went to the strip club to celebrate. I, I mean, well, when you put it like that. All right, mate. Put your hands behind your back. What? No, no, no! Come on! I didn't even do anything. Well, let the judge decide that, guy. Oh, come Why on! Why he say it so like that? Bogus. Order, 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 order. I am the see, see the judge says. Judge Poober, and today he better not say it in a bad way. In the case of Brooklyn guy, who is being accused of arranging the kidnapping of his own wife. Mm, 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 but first, I'd like to thank our courtroom sponsor for today, hey, Dragon yo. City. Yes, that's right. Today's trial is sponsored because our federal funding is quite limited. So everybody, <laughs> please direct your attention hey, to yo. the TV on the wall so we can that's watch funny. an ad by Dragon City. All right, let's get back to so, it, man. So, we can proceed with the case. So, did you kill your wife or what? No, Your Honor. Oh, I my. I not do anything bad to it's my right wife. It's right to it. I mean, yeah, there are some days I wish it was legal for me to hit her. And okay. there are some days I want to suffocate her with a pillow in her okay. sleep. Okay. The sweet feeling of her gasping last breath as she dies would be the greatest feeling in the world. But every husband feels that way about their wife sometimes, right? Mmm, yes, I can agree. My wife can get on my nerves sometimes, too. But I'm a little confused. Why would you say that off rip, though? When you realized your wife had been kidnapped, you went to the strip club. Why didn't you? <laughs> Call 911. Oh, oh well, I thought whoever kidnapped my wife would probably bring her back after five minutes because she's annoying as hell. Also, okay. there was a stripper I've always wanted to pap, and I thought this would be my only chance to go to the strip club without my wife calling me asking me where I was. Well, it's just a little suspicious that you didn't call the police. It's almost like you were celebrating that your wife had been kidnapped. Yeah, he definitely oh, was come celebrating. On, Your Honor, I would never celebrate anything bad happening to my wife. You can ask anybody; they'll tell you I love her. Like Sim Simmons, don't I love my wife? No. But don't don't listen to Simmons. He doesn't know what he's talking about. Ask anybody else. You ask the right, hater. Then let's ask your daughter, Penelope. Would you say your father? Hates his wife? I Would he ever head. cause harm to her? Oh, my dad hates her. He always <laughs> says she's annoying and he's always being oh, mean to her. Man. My dad likes to play Grand Theft Auto and run over women with a car and he pretends it's his wife. He would definitely hire someone to kill her. I see. Oh, come on. No, nah, that's crazy. Your Honor, I hate you. Uh, look, if you just give me a chance to clear my name, I promise I will do that. Hmm. Okay, I'll tell you what. I give you 12 hours to prove you are innocent. But if you can't prove you I didn't gonna do, do that, this, though. I will bang this gavel so hard and sentence you to the electric chair. 
deal, Your Honor. Man, I can tell. Marvin, I want to get my nails done. Jeffy! Puppets, we don't have nails. Oh, man. <laughs> hey, guys. Yeah, that's true. You just walk into our house without asking or ringing the doorbell? Yeah, it's really important. I'm in a lot of trouble. What's going on? Well, my wife get kidnapped. Oh, no! Well, your wife got Where kidnapped. Keep from? Who would do that? I don't know, but the worst part is everybody thinks I did it, and now I have 12 hours to prove my innocence or I'm going to get the electric chair. What, well, what evidence do they have that you did do it? Well, none, really, but I mean, hey, we need a problem, right? Okay, so who do you think would kidnap your <laughs> wife? Who would want her? I don't know. Not I don't know no who one, would bro. want her. I don't even want her. I guess that's why I'm the prime suspect. I don't think anybody hates my wife more than I do. Hell, maybe I did do it, and I just don't remember. Hey, um, uh... Did you do it? No, 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 I couldn't. <laughs> Was well, there anyone that hates you sure. is trying to frame you? Hates me? Me? I'm Brooklyn T guy. I carry these you videos. Name is Look T? at any top ten list. I guarantee I'm number one. And if I'm number two, it's right after this bozo. I'm like, come on. Look at him. I mean, I carry those videos. That is so, you know, nobody hates me. Where am I on the list? Oh, you're not even top ten. You're not even top twenty. You're right at the bottom, right under Mr. Pig and Corn Dog. Dang. Oh. Okay, let's stay on track. Who do you think would kidnap your wife? With Marvin on the list. No, I don't even know where you go to hire goons to kidnap wives. Oh, hold on, my phone's ringing. Maybe my wife. Uh, nah, Brooklyn uh, guy is guys, top one. I was trying line. to say before I ran out like a babbling idiot and definitely didn't forget my line is hopefully they let my wife go and that's her calling me. But I can see from the caller ID it's not my wife. That's funny. It's my ex-wife. What? Uh oh, why would she be calling us? You got an so ex-wife? Hello? Ooh, hey there, guy. Who does that it's sound me, like? Deborah Dimple Hey there, Deborah. Who is that? Hey, look at me. Oh, that's it sounds like Mr. Meeseeks. We didn't have a lot yeah, of about say. voices. Deborah, what do you want? Morgan, what are you? How do you know if I say that? You picked up Penelope from school today. Yes, I did, Deborah. Oh, we thank you. <laughs> and I, I yeah. saw what happened to your wife, and she got kidnapped. Oh, what a shame! Who would that do that? Sus. Not me. Guys, I'm starting to think maybe Deborah kidnapped my wife. Oh, so I, I was wondering if maybe you wanted to get back together. There's the motive. Hey, Deborah, I think maybe you should come over so we can talk about this. Ooh, is it gonna be food? Yeah, there's gonna be food. Ooh, is it gonna be a lot of food? Yeah, a lot oh of food. Oh, my. Ooh, we can do What in the world? Okay, just call me when you get here. Actually, you know what? You don't have to. I'll hear the dump truck pulling in. Damn, he ain't like none of his life. Like. Wait, why is she coming here? Well, because I'm 99% sure she kidnapped my wife. So if we can just record her admitting it, I can show that to the judge and I won't get the electric chair. Okay. Hopefully he'll give her the electric whale tank because I don't think she's going to fit in a chair. Dang. Okay, so what can we use to, like, He's messing with a big girl? Palace? Oh, food. Well, well, what kind of food does she like? Oh, any food. It doesn't matter. Anything <laughs> with calories and yeah, fat. Any food. A lot of fat, lard, mayonnaise, butter. I mean, you, she'll eat anything she you put in front of her. She's like a goat. I saw her eat a can one time. Like a can of food? Yeah, like a can of SpaghettiOs. She couldn't open it, so she just ate the whole damn can. She just ate the whole oh my can? Gosh. Yeah, the whole thing. She has a stomach like a trash compactor. Okay, well, then we need to grab some food. Yeah, let's go get the food. Okay, Marvin, Ooh, I got that the food. Good. Whoa! That do look good, I ain't gonna lie. That look good. Burger King, oh, no, this is just for burgers. What, she can eat all this? Marvin, this is like a light snack for her. She's probably gonna complain because there's not enough food. I got five triple Whoppers with cheese triple and onion rings crazy. and bacon on them. And I got a bowl of ketchup to wash down her plate of french fries. And I got a chocolate shake. Oh, and she's oh, probably gonna complain because it's not filled all the way to the top. And, just to be safe, I, I got two bell. beefy five-layer burritos and two chalupas. She's gonna blow that toilet, boy. I just don't understand how she can eat all this. put in work in that toilet. Joey Chestnut look like a chump. She's banned from all eating competitions all around the world because of her bottomless stomach. Well, do you think this food's hey, gonna man. be good enough for her to admit that she kidnapped your wife? I hope so. Wait, Marvin. She you finna drop a dump truck back in? Hey, yo, what I really hear a dump truck. Oh, Marvin. Marvin, look. The ketchup's jiggling. She's off the dump truck. She's heading this way. She's coming. What, what do we do? There's nothing you can do, Marvin. Okay, she's at the door. I'll answer it because she eats people when she gets startled. Hello? Hey, Brooklyn guy! Yo! She got a large Deborah. Taco Bell hey, drink. Good to see you. Have you lost weight? No, I've gained 20 pounds, actually! Oh, well, you that's know, that's, that's Penelope's uh, mom. Wait, is, is that a beverage from Taco Bell? Yeah, I got hungry on the way here, so I ordered a little snack. <sighs> Thank you for that. Yeah, I ordered 12 chalupas because I was so hungry. Oh, your normal order. Well, that's great because you knew you were coming to dinner. So it's great that you ate first. Come on in. Ooh, we I'm starving. Oh, yeah, those 12 chalupas didn't hold you over? Yeah. <laughs> uh, what are you? What are chalupas? Is all this food for me? 
Yeah, I got you a whole buffet, just the fattest junk. Oh, are those triple whoppers? That's crazy. With cheese. And bacon. And onion and rings, bacon. just like you like them. See, Brooklyn guy, this is why we need to be together. You know my favorite whopper. Yeah, well, I think anybody could just look at you and guess it's the biggest one. That's crazy. Question. When did her voice start sounding like Mr. Meeseeks? Well, ever since she saw that one episode of Rick and Morty, she thought it was really funny and decided to sound like that for the rest of her life. It's me! Crazy. Look at me! I'm Mr. Meeseeks! Look at me! Oh, to be Lord. fair, it was a very good impression, but to keep that up for the rest of her it life is a commitment. If only she could commit to losing weight that much. Okay, well, we it have do to get sound really good, I know that. Wife. I know, I have an idea. Hey, Deborah, I think we should play some truth or dare. Oh, are you gonna dare me to eat all this food? <laughs> no, because you're gonna do that anyway. I was gonna ask you a truth. Oh, are you gonna ask me my weight? No. Oh, my. Okay, well that doesn't count. What I was gonna ask you is, did you have my wife kidnapped? No way! No. Uh. She lying, bro. Mr. Music's voice, I can't tell if she's being sarcastic or not. Like, was that serious? Uh, hold on. You gotta, you gotta like make the food. Me? Hello? She can't get food hey, tell the truth. What, Karen? Where are you? Are you safe? I'm back at home. At home? But where have you been? The kidnappers dropped me off, Boiny. They said I talk too much. Do you think I talk too much? I don't think I talk. Hey, too much. yeah. Oh my God! Shut up! Hey, That's man, too funny, bro. Well, he knew I'm it. I'm sorry for flashbanging you. I, I, we were gonna kidnap your wife and ask for ransom money, but holy shit, she's the most annoying thing I've Dang, ever seen that bad? in my life. So good luck, me and my partner. We're gonna turn ourselves in. Wow. wow. Yeah, she is pretty annoying, isn't she? Oh yeah. Uh, thank you. Well, my wife is safe. Wait, so your ex-wife didn't kidnap your mm current wife? No, 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 no. She's fine. Wait. Oh, but that means I just bought my fat ex-wife five triple whoppers and a whole bunch of junk food oh, no. and made her think I want to get back with her. Ooh, is this the part where I take all my clothes off? Hey, Deborah, I heard Krispy Kreme is offering three dozen donuts to the fattest person. I win! Ooh! Hey, it worked. I've yeah, never worry. seen her run that fast. The table she was moving. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna do that for a while. She's still running. She's about a seven on the Richter scale and a six hundred on a regular. Scale. He's moving though. Anyway, I'm gonna go tell the judge my wife is home. You might want to get under a table or something. Well, Who well, eat that food, well though? Brooklyn guy, you actually did it. You proved you were innocent. I guess you're free to go. Hit hit! Hooray! Woohoo! Yippee! Thank you again to Dragon City for sponsoring this <laughs> What the heck was video. that? Don't forget to click the link in the what, description what the heck was for that? special bundle of rewards. Said, yeah, but, all right. Who was your least favorite character? I don't, even, I don't even have a least favorite. I just know that Brooklyn Guy is my favorite. Make sure I go to the SML's page of that sub button over there, though, bro. Yo, Brooklyn Guy, man, your wife, your wife can't be that bad, bro. I think, I think they gassing it. She can't talk that much, bro. You telling me the kidnappers kidnapped her and took her back because she talked that much? That's crazy, bro. The real question is. If she's that annoying, why'd you pick her in the first place? You know what I'm saying? Because, hey, why didn't I know this whole time that was Penelope's a mother, though? I, th I thought Brooklyn Guy's current wife was a mother this whole time, but that makes a lot more sense because she do got red hair. And Brooklyn Guy don't got red hair. How did I not notice that? But I'm sorry for the lack of uploads lately. I'm, I'm about to get back on to it. So make sure y'all stay tuned with me, bro. Let me know what y'all want to see. And let me know if y'all enjoyed this video or not. Hit that like button, that sub button. It's your boy, it's K Reaction. Now, we at it.